Speaking with Moose Jaw Warriors head coach Mark O'Leary uh, ahead of uh, the first matchup with the Regina Pats uh, coming up this uh, on Wednesday night. Uh, I guess how much are you guys looking forward to uh, the first rivalry game against the Pats in Regina? I think uh, like we always talk about, there's some you know the, some extra juice when we're playing against Regina for sure. But uh, most importantly, we just uh, we're looking to execute and come away with two points. It was a tough start on the, the opening weekend. What's kind of been the focus over the last couple of days as you guys look to bounce back from those two games? Well, certainly, uh, you know, details, you know, starting with our tracking. I think it was, uh, it was evident in both games that, um, you know, whether it's, you know, coming into our zone or even in the offensive zone, a little more we can do to, to stop those odd man rushes. So, you know, those details are a big part of it. But really for me, it's, you know, one-on-one -on -one puck battles. If we can have the puck, you know, I like our chances of something positive happening. It's uh, when we lose those those one-on-one -on -one puck battles, whether it's the neutral zone or uh, the offensive zone and certainly the defensive zone that we get ourselves into trouble. Is it still a younger team? Is, is Was that a learning experience for those young guys in their first taste of WHL regular season action? Yeah, I hope so. You know, I think if you're if you're going to lose a game, you, know, you should learn something from it. And I think that was certainly uh, one of them. I know I know we're going to go through some growing pains here. Uh, we're a young group, like you mentioned, but um, you know, at the same time, I think uh, everybody has the the capability of competing and certainly uh, coming away with more one-on-one -on -one puck battles. Regina won their two games to open up the season. What what's going to be the key against them? Well, we talk about tracking and, you know, if you watch Regina play, they like to create foot races in behind our D and we just need to make sure that we have numbers above the puck. And then after that, it's, you know, the, the competitiveness coming back into our zone and winning those, uh, those puck battles in front of our net. You know, I thought uh, Brandon had way too, too much of an easy time finding loose pucks in front of our net. So if we can uh, clean up those two things, we're going to give ourselves a chance. Good luck uh, tomorrow night. Thank you.